Hello. Uh, the engine you're about to see is a 10cc rhombic drive engine that I made many years ago. I have uh, just resurrected it and um, done a few modifications to it. I have ha added a hand pump for pressurization. This little pump here. This canister here contains silica gel desiccant crystals because uh, the problem with uh, pressurizing a, ster um, a sterling cycle engine is you do suffer with uh, condensation inside the engine if, if you don't take the moisture out, out of it and uh, so um, it, which would cause uh, corrosion problems inside the engine so that is the, uh, the, uh, the underside of it here we have um, a generator which was uh, in its former life it was a um, capstan motor from a, a video recorder uh, which I've modified <coughs> this uh, little gadget here you might wonder what it is and that's a snifting valve that is uh, to, to ensure that the, the pressure at the, the top of, at the top of the piston the, the pressure up there is always greater than the, than the pressure in the crankcase and that stops the oil from migrating up into the uh, hot end I'm going to start it now hopefully I don't know whether I can focus into the, uh, the flame or now Let's see if it will start. Too much pressure there. There we are. The electrical output is approximately 5 watts, which isn't very good, uh, but it's a, um, only a half, half a watt for a cc. Pretty poor really, but it's a, only a very simple uh, hot cap, it's just a, a single hot cap. I'll put the chimney on there, it helps the combustion slightly. Just testing now the speed. 1,740 revolutions per minute. And the light's not very good. I'll see if I can add a little light. The window's got a bit dirty. The flame's gone out. I turned it down too far. Start up again now. There she goes. She's working at a pressure of approximately 15 pounds per square inch on the gauge. So that's um, 
running on two atmospheres, isn't that? Plus speed now, 2097 revolutions per minute. 2100. Take it off load now. Now doing two thousand two hundred and twenty. 